Hi guys, this is Mike from Website Builders Critic. Today I'm going to show you how to build a blog with Weebly in five minutes or less. When you first sign up for Weebly, the very first thing you're going to see when you log in is my site listed underneath your account. To get started with it, you simply need to click edit to be in the process. You're then going to be asked what type of website you'd like to focus on a standard website, a blog, or an online store. Obviously in this case we're going to choose blog, so click on that. You're then given a number of options for themes which you can change later. For now I'm just going to take a random one here and we'll go with this guy. Click on choose to load the template. You've now got an option of adding your own domain to the website so perhaps you may already own it you can use the bottom option here if you want to register a new one use the middle option and if you'd like just to you know say for instance mikesblog.weebly.com you can pick the top one for now let's do that happens to be taken so let's do mike j's blog there we go click continue now you can either click on plan site or build site i'm going to go with build site that gets us into the website on its very basic purpose. Now, as you'll notice with Weebly, when you hover over specific items, you get usually a little pop-up that comes up. First thing you're going to want to do, obviously, is change the name of your site. So click on that area and type in what you want to change. If you want to use a logo, obviously, you can click logo and upload one from your computer. You've basically got the beginnings of a website right away. You want to change your author information. You can put in some basic info there. And then you can basically start writing your, your post almost immediately. Just click on new post to write your first one. Put in your title. You can begin to add whatever elements you want in here. So all these various options on the left, you just drag them in to build your build your post. So you say, for instance, you want to put an image at the top, you bring in an image and drop it. I don't think there's any images in here by default, but let's take a quick look. Oh, there are, perfect. So you can buy images through Weebly apparently, or you can choose free. For now we'll just pick something random. Let's go with this cute looking turtle thing. There we go. You can make some option changes to the image if you need to. Then you drag in your text box and begin to write your post. This is my first post. Check out this cute turtle. You can then add categories. Decide whether you want to have it set up to share with Twitter or Facebook, in which case it's going to ask you to authenticate. We're not going to do that right now. And when you're ready, just click Publish Live, and your post will be published. Close that window, and here's your first blog. So as you can see, you've got Mike's blog. So if we want to go to it in a separate window, we can just open up uh, Mike J's blog here. And here's how it looks to a brand new visitor. There's your first post. You can add comments. Here's the about page, which you obviously need to modify and add text as needed. There's your contact page. Switching back to Weebly, when you want to make changes to your page, you just click on the pages icon at the top. Choose the page you want to make changes to and begin making your modifications. So we're gonna we pick short header, save and edit. It now loads it up, and then you're gonna bring in each individual piece of content. 
this is about me. If you want to put a title on the page, you just drag the title to the top. As you can see, it's incredibly straightforward. To make any design changes to the site, click on design. You've got theme changing capabilities such as colors, fonts, which you can modify, and the background. So we went a little bit over, five minutes and 30 seconds, but I think you get the general gist of it. To generally, to create a blog with Weebly, it takes maybe about two to three minutes. I just happen to take some extra time to show you around a bit more on the back end of Weebly. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, please subscribe below or share this post if you're reading it on websitebuilderscritic.com. Thanks again, and uh, please check back for new videos coming out every week. Thanks.